Hi, I'm Zareen Khan, and welcome to my new show, Spices and Secrets. a beautiful and rewarding relationship with cooking nurtured by my grandmother during my school going days later my mother in law bibi fatima begum khan actually ingrained in me the desire to learn the art of cooking since i enjoyed the best of mehman nawazi from my in laws i wanted to share that joy with everybody because a shared meal is the strongest glue that bonds relationships my mother in law always said a recipe that has no soul till you fill it with love and bring soul into it in each episode apart from sharing my precious recipes with you i will bring you the company of two close friends who have eaten at the Khan family table Since we are sharing the Khan family recipes it is apt that both my guests flag off our first episode They are co-actors and are right when they are together. So until our first guest arrives, I will give you my first recipe, which happens to be one of my personal favorites. Today we are making a very delicious dish called the Hyderabadi Bagara Bengal. This dish usually goes along with palaos and biryanis. and i'm going to teach you how to make it brinjals and i cut them to the way they are supposed to be done this dish turns very tasty because the bengal is soft and it absorbs all the various masalas that you put in and this is going to be a gravy dish now we put a lot of oil into this add at least half of the scan so it can be deep fried In the meantime I'll start cutting the onions lengthwise Okay now we put in the I think they're just about right and we let these fry See I think it's just getting ready to be drained out all the excess oil looks good and just the right color This is where we take our plate with the tissue to drain out all the excess oil Our next step is now I put the pan on the fire and again add some oil because now we're going to fry the onions Okay I think this we put in now I put in my garlic and the 10 Kashmiri red chilies and now we have to wait for this to become slightly brown now this has got to fry a little bit so now we take a quarter cup of grated coconut and there we brown the coconut also oh the coconut flavor is already coming and as it's being browned i start cutting the tomatoes and then we have to put all these items into a blender to get the masala for the bagara bengal i put the tomatoes that i've cut into this bowl then i add about quarter cup of imli into this and teaspoon each of the adrak lasun and some salt and i pour all this mixture i'm going to blend those for the masala so as all my masalas are going to be blended nice and proper to start the third process of this particular recipe so here we have the pan 
oil. Now a little bit of the jeera and some curry patta. All the masala has been blended and we pour all this masala into the rest of the things. And we mix it all up so that it can become into a nice, thick, luscious gravy. And then we can add the water. The brinjal has a couple of names that it is called by. One of them is a garden egg because of its shape. And can you imagine the other name is also, it's called the mad apple. I truly wonder why. Now I shall add the brinjals into this. See all of it is inside now in this? Because now we close the lid and let it cook in its own gravy for about 10 minutes more. You know, this dish is uh, liked mainly by a lot of people, but we all love it, especially when we are having our usual biryanis. So every time there is a biryani in our house, we have to have the bagara bangan. Because instead of a dal, this goes along better when used as a gravy for the biryani. I think it's all ready. So we add in the chilies now. And then, of course, the coriander. Give it a little stir. And close the lid again. And now slow the fire as usual and leave it on dum. In its, that means cooking in its own steam. Bagara means tadka. So it's all in all, it's the frying that merges and mixes the tastes and that brings out its flavor. So I hope when it's ready, you guys will love this Hyderabadi Bagara Bengal. So the Bagara Bengal is ready to be served and here we go. First I'll put the gravy and then leave it here. Presentation is very important. Little coriander that is left. So this is the Hyderabadi Bagara Bengal. And I'm sure you will enjoy it as much as we do. And if you missed anything, here's the recap. Take six to eight small brinjals Trim them from the base and make cross slits on it. Deep fry them and keep it on kitchen paper to remove excess oil. In a pan, heat oil, add 2 to 3 sliced onions, 10 to 12 garlic pods, de seeded 8 to 10 Kashmiri red chilies, and saute it till the onion softens. Add 1 4th cup grated coconut and saute it till it goes golden brown. Remove from the heat and cool it. In a bowl, add two chopped tomatoes, one fourth cup tamarind puree, one teaspoon ginger paste, one teaspoon garlic paste, salt to taste and fried onions. Grind the mixture to form a fine paste. In another pan, add oil, 1 teaspoon cumin seeds, 10 to 12 curry leaves and let them crackle. Now add the prepared paste, water as required, mix well and let it cook for 10 minutes. Add the fried brinjals, coat them nicely with the puree, cover the lid and let it cook for 10 to 15 minutes. Add 5 to 6 whole green chilies, freshly chopped coriander, and leave it for 5 minutes on slow fire. Garnish the dish with chopped coriander and serve hot. Your delicious Baghara Bengan is ready to be served. Later, I will be making my family's favorite recipe of mutton biryani with my first guest. 
and I'll be back to tell you all about him after a break. Welcome back. Our first guest on my show, who is opening the series, is the extremely popular actor Ritesh Deshmukh. He and his wife are very close friends of my children. I have known Ritesh since the time his father was the Chief Minister of Maharashtra. Even then, Ritesh was very down to earth and a very well mannered boy who never was affected by the trappings of fame and political clout. The credit goes to him for building up his own identity by sheer hard work. Ritesh made his entry in Hindi films in 2003 opposite Janelia D'Souza. Later, he fell in love with Janelia and got married to his leading lady. Today, he stands tall as an actor who has come into his own as a producer with his successful Marathi films. He's also a doting husband and a devoted father to two children. I can imagine how his mother's chest must swell with pride. I feel like that about him too. <laughs> how are you? How are you? So nice to see you. Oh, yeah. I'm so happy. Thank oh, you, Dina Wow, Piyo. how beautiful. Please come, come and sit Thank down. You. Please sit down. Thank you. Thank you, Auntie, for having me. Now, first, it's a pleasure. Tell me first, let me ask, how are your two little ones? Are very good. What have you named them? What's your name? The big name is Riyan and the small name is Rahil. Nice names also. Thank you. And I remember your dad so well. Of course, your mother is very special. But your dad was also a wonderful man. Thank huh? you. Thank but I like your whole family. Even your father was a chief minister of Maharashtra and all the rest. But he... You are so down to earth and so, I mean, you know, grounded and all the brothers, each one of you all are very close-knit in family, no, isn't it? And I think that your core strength is a family. But you had a very beautiful love story with your wife also, no, from the first picture. Under my genie, there are five years of five years. So, when we started the shooting, we became very good friends. So, I don't know when that friend was coming. I love her smile. मेरा कुछ contribution नहीं लेकिन फिर भी thank you. Almost पांच साल हो गए शादी को ना we have two lovely kids so I want to ask you one more thing आंटी. You know we've always spoken about this but how was your love story? अरे अरे we we should know we I I would like to know I'm sure you would want to know. My love story started my love with food actually because you see what happened is when I was a very young I used to be neighbors with my husband I remember I was only in my ninth tenth standard actually but even he was very young I was very young he was only seventeen and a half eighteen maybe. Ah so before films happened or whatever. Films happened anything and every time I used to pass I used to see a very sweet lady on the terrace and she used to wave at me. And I used to wonder how sweet this lady, very pretty lady with, you know, lovely long hair and fair and all. So I started raving at her, not knowing who it was, anything. Sure. And guess who that eventually turned out to be? My future mother-in-law. Wow. And when she used to look at me walking by, she used to say, this girl is very sweet. I should give her five sons to my five sons. Next thing, it was a long story. We met on the beach and all the rest. And the best thing is, when I first went to his house, Ji. his mother took an immense liking to me. So she, because I was young, you know, when you find a young girl, then automatically you have more uh, that affection or whatever sure. it is. And she used to be the most extraordinary cook. And I was a sports girl, so I used to always be hungry. <laughs> So I used to eat a lot and when I used to go to the house, the first thing that used to attract me was the food, the, food. the smell of the food. Of course, besides being attracted to my husband, but I the food that used to come out was just, I mean, too good to be true. And when I enjoyed it, she was the happiest to say, Isko to abhi daughter in law banani hai. So, so basically, what <laughs> you're started. telling me is that you like your daughter, so you married your daughter. No, it's not such a thing. First the beta, then the satsuma. Like this, our love story grew and the food story grew. So I used to write all the... But talking of food, I'm going to teach you how to make a nice biryani. A mutton biryani. Lovely. My favourite. And then you learn it up and surprise Janelia how you can make the biryani. Don't tell anyone. We'll learn right now. Let's go. Let's go. Now, 
first we put the pan on here. Right. So we put the oil into the pan. Every dish mainly, we have to add the spices. The spices. So there is a few of the cloves, elaichi, elaichi. three major domos, and then the dalchini. These are the spices that give you the, the flavor, flavor, the flavor. The flavor. Just let it sizzle a little bit. Then in the meantime, sure. we take the onions okay. and we cut them lengthwise. We take all the onions and put them into this oil. Of course, we'll also add the salt, uh, one and a half to two teaspoons. Okay, two teaspoons. The next thing what we do, first you put two teaspoons red chilli. Then you put one teaspoon of dhania powder. powder. Huh? Okay. And then you put half a teaspoon of haldi. So then again you mix all this up. We put the mutton. Now we mix the meat. So we put two teaspoons yes, adarak, the garlic. And then we again, this has all got to be very well browned. It's amazing. Huh? Okay, now, as this is being fried, we start cutting the tomatoes. First into half. Should I cut it for you? Are you good in cutting? I can try. Don't cut your fingers. No, 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 get it. I'll do it. Huh? Yeah, come. You really will? Yeah, then yeah, go like this. Okay, let's see. So, now. Ah, yes, very good. Wow, you're cutting it like a professional. Yeah, almost <laughs> done now, yes. Okay, fine. Now we put all of this into the meat. The cooking also becomes simple and it's always better. Close this. How much time will that take now? Uh, I think about another 10 minutes. Now the meat should be ready. I'll just take a little peep. Yes, see. Ah. Huh? It's amazing. Wow. Now, the next step, we pour the yogurt into it. See, look at the color that will come with the yogurt. Put it sure. aside. This is like magic. Then, what we do, we add the kothmir goes in, pudina, full green chilies, about six of them. Now, we add a little bit of the garam masala, which is, you know, pounded, all the oh, masalas. Right. And, yeah, delicious flavor at the end, you know. Oh, wow. We mix this up. This is the Khan style biryani. Khan style biryani, that wow. That we do. Secret is spices and secrets. Spices and secrets. <laughs> okay, now, say, you prepare a dish like this. Uh, I think this is an amazing gravy dish. Yes, you can eat so, it. Yeah, yes, without is, without adding yes, rice, this this can be a absolutely, gravy dish. Absolutely, but it's got to be cooked. Cooked, right? Of course. And then last, we add the potatoes. These are the potatoes which I have boiled and fried slightly and kept. So after about say five to ten minutes, I'm going to add the uh, potatoes into it. See, so wow. there, I'm just keeping it here. Ready. And when it's ready. Ritesh, so I think now the meat should be ready. Wow. So we open it. Oh, look at that. I like think we melting pot. just switch this off for the moment. We put the first, we take the rice and we spread it across here. Oh, so that's the first layer. That's the first layer. Okay. Then we leave this here and now take this and I put it like this. Okay, then we back again to this. The rice goes on top of this. This layer we put in the potato. Potatoes, okay. So we put the potato, just put it like this, you know, stick it in a little bit. Now back again to the... The gravy. Gravy. Yeah. The layer of the gravy. Now we back again, we'll put the rice. rice. Now, 
we pour in this kesar dood oh okay now this for the pure ghee ka tadka you know which you put ghee ka tadka ha ah. wow. so that means you How put how many tablespoons i think two and a half okay now it's done and we pour this we close this put this on low fire for how much time for about i think maximum 5 to 7 minutes oh that's it okay yeah. okay ritesh our biryani is done there goes but the whole fun of this is how you take it out and who in a family loves this the most my grandson yuraz He loves biryanis. He always says, "Let's go to eat Nani's biryani." I'm going to add a little bit of coriander. The coriander, and I'm going to make you smell and see. Ah, jannat, <laughs> heaven. You mean it? It's really yeah, smelling yeah, it's, good. Yeah, it's just amazing. Mmm, and you have to taste it, try it, and then let me know. And if you've missed anything. Here's the recap for mutton biryani in a pan add oil add 5 to 6 cardamom 6 to 8 cloves and 2 to 3 cinnamon sticks for added flavor and fry 3 sliced onions until it becomes light golden brown now add salt to taste 2 tsp red chili powder 1 tsp coriander powder 1/2 tsp turmeric powder and mix well add 500 g mutton pieces into the pan and mix to coat it with all the spices add 2 tsp ginger paste 1 tsp garlic paste 2 to 3 finely chopped tomatoes mix well and let it cook for 40 to 45 minutes add 1 and 1/2 cup of yogurt freshly chopped coriander few fresh mint leaves 5 to 6 whole green chilies 1 tsp garam masala and give it a good mix let it cook for 8 to 10 minutes in its own juice do not add water at any stage in another pan spread cooked white rice on the base then place the cooked meat fried potatoes and repeat the layering sprinkle half cup of saffron mixed milk and 2 tablespoon melted ghee over the last layer and cook on slow fire for 15 to 20 minutes serve the biryani on serving plate and garnish it with chopped coriander your yummy mutton biryani is ready to be served we'll be back soon so come and meet us after the break before my next guest arrives who happens to be my pride and joy let me tell you something about my youngest son zaid Zaid and Ritesh have been friends since many years and together they are a riot. Zaid, being the youngest after my three girls, was very pampered by our entire family. He happens to be an extraordinary cook and can whip up amazing food which are mouth-watering and is appealing to the eye. I think this is the talent he has inherited from his father. Hi, Ma. What's up? Hi, Daddy. Oh, you're back. Oh, wow. What are you doing with my best friend? Um, yeah, Zico. 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 Oh. He's a. Huh? He's the. He's the statesman actor. Statesman of the of the <laughs> film industry. I can say this. No, okay. चलिए बैठिए बैठिए पहले. Why do you call him statesman, brother? First. Then. Firstly, I have to tell you, this was a. a Crazy, no, 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 crazy. You, you, no, no, no. Wait, you wait. can't talk about the flight. I'm telling you, no, no, no. no you, you can't talk about the flight. तो एक वक्त में हम लोग सब जा रहे थे और रितेश यू नो पहले तो है ही जेंटलमैन आदमी यू नो जब भी किसी से बात करता है बहुत ही मतलब यू नो तमीज से बात करता है बहुत जेंटलमैन आदमी है सॉफ्ट स्पोकन यू नो अभी हम लोग सब प्लेन में बैठे हैं सब लोग सो रहे हैं और कोई ऐसे सो रहा है कोई आंगड़ा सो रहा है कोई टेढ़ा सो रहा है रितेश ऐसे सो रहा है कि बहुत नीटली इसके ऊपर एक ब्लैंकेट ऐसे उड़ा हुआ है <laughs> और ऐसे सो रहा है जैसे कि वो अभी सुपरमैन की नो बने हो कि इस ऐसा तो जब वो उठा मैंने बोला यार तू जब सोता है 
स्टेट्स में सोते वक्त भी लगता है मुझे यार मतलब जिंदा तो है ही स्टेट में लेकिन सोते वक्त भी ऐसे सोता है यार इजिप्शियन मम्मी की तरह हाँ जैसे कि मतलब एक भी फोल्ड क्रीज भी नहीं है इसके यहाँ पे सब झूठ है प्लीज बिलीव ना कीजिए है हमारे कमेडियन रितेश क्या तो इतने दिन अभी आप पचास साठ दिन हम लोग साउथ अफ्रीका में केप टाउन और शूटिंग चल रही थी और काफी दिन तक यू नो हम बहुत हेल्थ कॉन्शियस आए सब लोग जिम जा रहे थे उस वक्त रेगुलर और अजय देवगन जायद मैं हम सब इकट्ठा जाते थे ऐसे ऑफ डे हुआ करते थे कि चलो आज कुछ भी खा सकते हैं और उस वक्त यू नो यू क्रेव स्टार्ट क्रेविंग फॉर इंडियन फूड कि कब हमें खाना मिले तो एक दिन जायद बोले कि आई एम गोइंग टू कुक तो मैंने कहा मर गए यार जायद अभी अभी क्या पकाएंगे मुझे पता नहीं लेकिन फिर शॉपिंग के लिए फिर गाड़ी निकाली हम लोग सुपरमार्केट गए चिकन विकन मसाला मसाला जो भी आता है लेके आए और बैठ गया मैंने किसी को कहा कि यार ये तो ठीक है ना बैकअप प्लान क्या है <laughs> क्योंकि बैकअप होना जरूरी है बैकअप होना जरूरी है तो इन्होंने शुरू किया म्यूजिक कोई कहीं नाच रहा है फिर सेट पानी डाल रहा है हर हर जगह हर जगह और थोड़ा ये डालो फिर डांस करके आओ फिर थोड़ा नमक डालो फिर थोड़ा चक्कर मार के आओ अमेजिंग बताओ और उसके बाद में बैठा हूँ एंड इट वॉज अन हमने कहा था इस डिश का नाम हमने रखा था शोले 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 बिकॉज इट वॉज कॉन्स्टेंटली हिट और उसके बाद मेरे दरवाजे पे घंटी बजी टिंग टोंग अजय कुछ बना रहा है क्या अजय आ जा हो रहा है फिर एकदम आधे घंटे बाद रितेश टिंग टोंग कुछ बना रहा है क्या तो ऐसे बन बन के ऐसे पांच छह लोग फिर, फिर तीन दिन बाद शायद क्या शाम का प्लान है कुछ नहीं बैठा शोले करे अच्छा दैट्स हाउ यू कॉल्ड द शोले वी कॉल्ड इट शोले बिकॉज़ इट वाज द बिगेस्ट हिट आई थिंक इट वाज अमेजिंग मैं आपको बताना चाहूंगा कि फाइट क्लब में ना जायद पूरी बॉडी बना के आ चुके थे और के कौन ब्रैड पिट मैं जायद वो कॉन्फिडेंस फिर उधर से डीनो आए उन्होंने बॉडी बना दी उन्होंने कहा कि कौन जायद नाम फाइट क्लब मैंने इसलिए साइन की फाइट क्लब चलो कुछ एक्शन पिक्चर करते बहुत कॉमेडी हो गई आंटी एक फाइट सीन नहीं दिया मुझे उन्होंने नहीं नहीं मेरे वजह से एक फाइट सीन नहीं दिया मुझे बाद में पता चला कि इन दोनों ने मिलकर सारे फाइट सीन दोनों बांट लिए मुझे एक और क्लाइमैक्स में मुझे लगा एटलीस्ट क्लाइमैक्स में मुझे कुछ मिलेगा तो डायरेक्ट आया था सर आप बहुत इंटेलिजेंट हो आई सर जब पिक्चर साइन की थी तब कहा गया पूरा क्लाइमैक्स में आंटी पिलर के वहां बैठा हूँ ऐसे पेट पकड़ के ऐसे किसने मारा मेरे को नहीं किसी ने मारा होगा आपको तो सब लोग एक्शन करे केबल में जाए दस लोगों को मार रहे मैंने एक पिक्चर पहली एक्शन फिल्म मैंने की और बोले गए और मतलब क्लोजअप है नहीं क्लोजअप नहीं लेकिन बैकग्राउंड में तुम बैठे हो तुम कोरे में बैठ जाओ तो पूरा दिन एक फाइट सीन आया मेरा और मैंने कहा बस दिस इज इट ये मेरा फाइट सीक्वेंस है और सीक्वेंस ऐसा था कि दरवाजा खुलता है और बाहर कुछ पचास गुंडे आ चुके हैं और सीन ऐसा था कि जिसको मारना है मारो जो पकड़ के मारो तो हम लोग अंदर गए यस यस जायद के ऑलरेडी काफी सारे एक्शन सीक्वेंस हो चुके थे मेरा पहला था और मैंने कहा इस बार तो मैं दिखा दूंगा अभी एक ही तो मौका मिला है और दरवाजा खुला एक्शन कैमरा काफी दूर थे और सब लोग भागे पूरा डस्ट ऐसे धुआं धुआं हर जगह धूल और दोपहर की धूप और सब लोग मारे और डस्ट ऐसे धीरे धीरे सेटल तो हीरोइक शॉट था कि जब डस्ट सेटल हो जाए तो सब लोग नीचे सिर्फ हीरो खड़े और हीरोइक शॉट था तो डस्ट जैसे सेटल होता है जायद ऐसे खड़े सोहेल वहां पर खड़े डीनो खड़े डीनो मौर्य आशीष चौधरी खड़े और ऐसे देख रहे हैं कि एक मिसिंग है मैं इतना थक गया तो मैं नीचे लेटी रितेश इज टू स्वीट इन दैट आई थिंक मुझे उठाया गया बाकायदा उठाया गया रियली और इतना मैं ही स्ट्रोक से परेशान था ऐसे हो गया था मैं गया और फिर ऑफ कोर्स ऐसा कोई प्रोफेशन नहीं जो जायद नहीं जानते तो कुक तो कुक है लेकिन उस वक्त तो डॉक्टर बन गए थे तो उन्होंने कहा मूव 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 उन्होंने मेरा पैर ले लिया शौक से और फिर ऐसे घिसने लगे और मैं इतना ब्रेथलेस था कि मुझे आवाज नहीं आई थी और मेरा पैर ऐसे ऊपर था और मैं बोलना चाहता कि मुझे ऑलरेडी गर्मी हो रही थी पैर क्यों घिस रहा है नहीं 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 मैं ऐसा कर You after common days now I believe you are making Shivaji. So can you tell us something about Shivaji? How all? Yeah, because first of all you have to put on 
a little bit of bulk or not really? So as of now, we thought we'll make this film. We are working on it, um, and um, it's such a vast life. 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 It क्या कहते हैं उसे प्रॉब्ली गुरिला वॉफर एंड ड्रामा बिहाइंड एंड पॉलिटिक्स बिहाइंड क्या हुआ था उस वक्त हैविंग सेड दैट ब्रदर आई थिंक नोबडी इज गोइंग टू बी अ बेटर शिवाजी देन यू अरे हाउस यू रियली हैव इट इन योर इन योर गट एंड एंड आल्सो आई फील दैट हिस्टोरिकली एंड हिस्टोरिक्स दैट हैव बीन मेड टीपू सुल्तान हैज बीन एज आइकॉनिक एज एवर एंड आल्सो अ लेजेंडरी वॉरियर स्टेट्समैन दैट आई डिडंट नो अबाउट हिम बट समन हु लिव इन मुंबई गॉट टू नो मोर अबाउट इट कि बहुत जरूरी होता है कि ऐसे हीरोज की कहानी आप फिर से बनाए आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टेल यू यू गाइज आर नॉट हंग्री So Zaid, this is the biryani which Ritesh has helped me make. अरे तालियां भाई, it's looking fab, it's looking. So as I think you please all of you attack. I will wait uh, first. Shall I let, start let's, serving you? Let's, since Ritesh, the uh, labor of love has been yes put into it. I'm dying to eat. One minute, please eat it. Ritesh, spicy you food you also love, right? I love spicy. Yeah. मुझे लगता है खाने में spice ना हो. एक मिनट, एक मिनट. अरे life में भी spice ना तो मजा नहीं. नहीं मजा नहीं है. <laughs> there goes and of the course, gym. <laughs> with this, you have to have the bagara bai. Yes. Okay. I'm ready. Zaya, First bread, ma'am. I think I, I will have a little, a little biryani, little meat, uh, uh. and little rice. Amazing. Ye to wow, God. I'm digging it with my hands, guys. Please, 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 work. Uh. So, Ritesh, Maharashtrian food also is like. Uh, Really spicy food, no? It is, it is. It's like misal pao and all. Misal pao and all. Mudha, more street Mumbai food, mm. but authentic Maharashtrian food because we come from Maratwada area. And right. Kolhapuri mm. chicken is different. Correct. And chicken and mutton flavors keep changing. And even, even bharle le vanga. Ah. It's amazing. What's that? What's that? Bharle le. That means it's. They, they, they stuff the stuff the, 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 the aubergine with wow. masala. Oh. It's, it's amazing. So basically, mm. it's um, it's stuffed with. A lot of masala we make with um, peanut, with mm. peanuts, with huh? peanuts. Yeah, like. Is that because it uh, it's uh, indigenous to the area? It is. It is indigenous area and mirchi is a thetsa. Ha, what's that? Mirchi is a thetsa. Oh, oh man, I love that. That. That's spicy. that you can also like have with your power down the side. Yeah, yeah absolutely. You know? yes, it's amazing. What sort of dishes does Janelia cook or no? Yeah, yeah, she does. She does. She she's now uh, started um, cooking some marinated chicken. Huh. Okay, it's amazing. Your Truffle friend dishes. Pasta. Wow. And then uh, now, what we have decided because I don't know how to cook, mm. so I just thought whenever I get some free time, let's go and start learning how to cook. Oh, together. nice! I have to tell you a very funny story. Mm -hmm. So I was in New York, I was studying there, mm. um, and working there as an architect. Mm. I was alone for the first time mm. in my life. Mm. I have gone out somewhere alone. Mm. So of course, New York, Manhattan, some restaurant. Mm. When they alone sat on one huge. Like a French restaurant, mm -hmm. one corner table alone. And I was very nervous, so I didn't know how to speak to people and what to say, what, what would be the right yeah, etiquette. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I sat there, and the menu came to me. I said, I "Feel like having an egg." Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the menu, I said, "Can you give me an egg?" <laughs> <laughs> Because I didn't know. I thought, "Abuji, the French all the Ritesh, chalenge America." <laughs> <laughs> अभी एक ही सब्जी को कितने नाम दोगे यार इतना क्यों कंफ्यूज कर रहे हो एक प्लांट भी है ब्रिंजोल भी है ऑबिजिन भी है सो माय मॉम इवन व्हेन शी गोस टू अ मिशलिन स्टार रेस्टोरेंट ओके लवली यू नो दैट बेक्ड यू नो इन रॉक सॉल्ट द लैम कम्स आउट द लवली सैलेड द रुगला एंड एवरीथिंग ऑल स्प्रेड आउट सडनली फ्रॉम बर्स ना टू ग्रीन चिलीज विल कम आउट 
and while she's eating, cut, cut, cut. You know, she's put the chilies on the table, and you know how these French waiters are. You know, they're kind of very, uh, you know, uh, accurate, Snobbish. very accurate about what is on the plate and what yeah, comes sure. out. So they go to the plate, they see it. <laughs> Like that wasn't there on that plate. Mm. So he comes to his mom and he says, Excuse me, ma'am, thinking that, you know, he might say, Ma'am, I don't think this was, you know, a prudent of you to like bring your green chilies. He sure. actually goes to her and says, Can I have some of those? <laughs> <laughs> it's happened with me. <laughs> He's asked me not one, but so many of the way. And sometimes, you know, they go back and they talk about these two ladies from India who really eat hot food. <laughs> so literally, I'm not joking, once or twice, the chefs have come out to see who are these people who are eating, consuming so many chilies. Because when the plate went, there were about six chilies, because all bland food, so six chilies. <laughs> six chilies going back, you know how it is. But I believe that that gives the spice of no, life. Of course, it does. So happy to see all your plates it's cleaned finished. up. Wow, that's great. Ritesh. Huh? You enjoyed it? I loved it. <laughs> Uh, can I get a green to lift? <laughs> so you all have had fun and enjoyed your meal, I hope. It's Arali. too good. Too yeah. good. Thank you. Well, I think the only thing much. to relish right now is the couch. Okay. So we are going to have some more musty with my boys. So join us after the break for some more fun. Oh my God. Vitesh, I have to <laughs> say. I have overeaten. I was so impressed. You're joking. With your biryani, I have to cover my stomach now. I, I, I have to look. say that I was so impressed with my own biryani, my God. <laughs> you oh, ate too much. I have, I have overeaten, I have overeaten. Kya that was even. killer, man. You really did that, huh? Yeah, that when Guru is good, then Shishya ka kaam is good. Now we are going to have a few true blue Ritesh moments when the cancering machine round begins. Ready to go crazy? Auntie, what is the answering machine round? The answering machine first is we are the Khans. Absolutely. So it's got to be the answering machine. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> and, and I'm going to ask you funny questions Jee. or some general knowledge questions. Yes, yes, absolutely. And whoever answers the fastest yeah. and the right answers okay. will get the point. So let's start. Yes. Ritesh, what film did Zayed play himself in? Om Shanti Om. Uh, yeah. Got right. Very close. <laughs> Only that I was in that song in Om Shanti. That's what we all were there. <laughs> we were playing ourselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we came as Ritesh and Zayed. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. That's true. Zayed, yes. which producer director made three films where he got critical acclaim? I would say um, RGV. Ram yeah. Gopal Varma. Yes, yeah, huh? that's true. Well yes. done, yeah. RGV. I must say. But yeah. you, huh? you've forgotten the names of the films? Or I, was it for, uh, for one was, um, uh, I'm forgetting one second. What can you can you notch? Yes, ah, notch. Yes. yes. And the second? Yes. And the second was um, run. Yeah. Oh, oh, run. Oh, run. Oh, run. Oh, run. Run. Amazing. I'm really good. And, yeah. and the third one, but that was a little longer. Yeah. Darna, darna, darna. Darna, zaruri. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, my God. Well done. Yeah. Yeah. Unbelievable. Oh, I must say they are brothers in arms. Yeah. So and shall God. I say the secret? No, no, no. Each one is helping in the not other. Not at all. Not at all. Under the breath. Not at all. No, no. I'm just turning a mustache. He's getting into that Shivaji mode from now. Well, I'll excuse you because you're so close. You keep on wanting to help each other. But now don't do that again. Gee, we'll try, we'll try. <laughs> okay, Ritesh, which film did Zayat go deep sea diving in? Blue! Oh, that was so easy. I no, no, no. no. <laughs> I had to really dig deep to find the treasure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, God. What was Ritesh's first Marathi action film? Yeah, I know that film because I watched it library. Yeah, yeah, yeah. baby, you yeah, know what? I'm a fortune in that. Man. Name three fruits that are commonly mistaken for vegetables. Tomatoes. Tomato. Um, um, aubergine. Aubergine, no, no, no. And no. and karela. Yes. Oh. I must say Very he good. got the answer first. Very good. I knew tomato for sure. Indians use a lot of potatoes, tomatoes, and chilies. Where do they come from? Farms. Yeah. <laughs> Who brought them first into India? Into India? Yeah. So the potatoes? Portuguese? Okay. One point. <laughs> Not <laughs> bad, man. Not bad. Okay. Not bad. Now, where was chicken tikka masala? Scotland! 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 Chicken tikka masala was in Scotland. 
You're kidding me. Yes, really. Someone chicken one. tikka masala is in Scotland. Scotland, yeah. In Scotland, huh? yes. ये मुझे लगा तुम मतलब आंसर इन ग्लासगो 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 या ओके व्हाट सिक्स फ्लेवर्स कंस्टिट्यूट अ टिपिकल इंडियन मील बिटर सॉस स्वीट स्पाइसी पंजेंट सॉल्टी सॉल्ट नो दैट्स नो से इट अगेन सावर बिटर सावर स्वीट स्पाइसी पंजेंट सॉल्टी सार सॉल्टी सार सॉल्टी नो सार सॉल्टी एंड सार आर डिफरेंट नो Sour would be sorry, khatta. Khatta. So salty would be salty. Namkeen. Nam. Namkeen. Okay. Salty is namkeen. Now what do I do when they both give equally? They are helping each other and even giving the answers together. No, no, but together. come on. Who gave the first five? <laughs> yeah. And what? Huh? Astringent. Astringent. Me kuch nahi hai. Nahi hai. Aisa tha. Wo chai to Glasgow me koi gali me gus gaya hoga. Wo astringent bhi bolne wa. Astringent. Give me the answer. It's sweet, salty. Salty. Bitter and spicy, and sour. Yeah. Sour. What's the sixth one? Astringent. Astringent. You were right. Yeah. लगता है तेरी एक्सपेक्टेशंस बहुत कुछ सिखा रहे तुमने. बहुत कुछ सिखा रहे. हाँ. So it's four. Uh, I'll, I'll give it to you because four to two. Four to two. Four to two. Okay. चलिए. Okay. Let's see. It's still coming. <laughs> Who discovered dum cooking? Dum cooking in India. Nawab Abad. Mughals. Mughal ne Nawab Abad. Nawab Abad. 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 Yeah, you know what they did, right? Uh-huh. They used to cook everything together with one bread thing. Correct. Yeah. So that's how dum dum cooked. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I must say, correct. Not bad, huh? Yeah, five. Yeah. Very good. Cute. First of all, you were cheating in the first round. No, no, we didn't cheat. And we helping cheat. each other, left, right, and centre, brothers yeah. in arms. I would say. But I was especially uh-huh. like impressed with the dum uh, dum cook. Okay, then Zaid, give it. To yeah, please. Give Ritesh. it. To wow, how sweet. Yes. Ritesh, I was especially impressed by. Thank this. you. Thank you. Enjoy, my brother. Enjoy. Give Enjoy. it to Janelia. Give it to Janelia. Janelia. Yes. Thank you, Janelia. Good evening. They're coming home. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And with a biryani chef. Yeah, yes. with a biryani khan samosa chef. But Khansama. not so fast. Gee. Since you have been so lovely and bonded together, and you wanting to always pointing that he should get, so I've kept one even for you. Oh, wow. Wow. sweet mom. Here's one hamper for you. Oh Pick wow. Up, it's too heavy for me. Okay, thank you, mom. <laughs> All right, here we go. Wow. ये so? इसे कहते हैं माँ का प्यार <laughs> और भाई का प्यार ये से कहते हैं <laughs> नहीं नहीं थैंक यू ऑल आई कैन से थैंक यू रितेश एंड थैंक यू जायद थैंक यू फॉर कमिंग हियर ऑन द शो यू टू हैव मेड मी लाफ सो मच You वंडरफुल बॉयज दैट आई कैन से एनी मोर रियल थैंक यू थैंक यू आंटी थैंक यू सो मच That brings us to the end of today's show with the promise of many more celebrity friends and interesting recipes and stories as we go along on the culinary journey. So tune in to Spices and Secrets. See you in the next episode. Till then, enjoy your family time. Mm-hmm.